we play. We fight. We conquer. Welcome back to the Freak Show. I am your host today, Bumpy McSquiggums, and we're returning to Warriors Orochi 3 Ultimate Definitive Edition, or the UDE, as it were. Uh, for those of you who are potentially wondering, uh, this is a game I believe was originally released around 2012 on the PlayStation 3. Uh, it's been a while since I looked this up uh, a while ago before I posted the video and all that. But yes, I believe that's about right. And this is uh, that edition coming to, you know, the forefront to uh, PC and uh, being re-released here in uh, 2022. So about 10 years on of its original release. So you'll see that things are a bit different than, we'll say, more modern-day Warriors games. But uh, apparently, uh, from a lot of the folks that I've spoken to, this is actually an incredibly good one. So I I'm looking forward to it. All right, but again, but again, we're going to be missing some of the stuff that we uh, have grown to appreciate and love. Like, I just recently fired up, I don't remember exactly what it's called. I think it's Dynasty Warriors Gundam. Hold on, I have it. I have it right here. I'm just gonna, just gonna give me a minute here as I stretch and I pick it up. Oh, okay. It was, it was less, less difficult than I thought it was going to be. Uh, Dynasty Warriors Gundam Two. So I, I recently fired that up. I'm like, oh, there's no lock on. There's this. There's that. You know, so stuff that, um, you know, slowly has creeped in and been added to the entire Warriors series is stuff that you notice, you know, back in the day wasn't there once you go back in the day to play it. So, I'm here for it, though. Uh, Warriors games are always good, in my opinion, or at least they have been. I've enjoyed them, so let's let's continue our adventures. All right, I, it will probably take me a little while to get used to the, the fact that the camera just likes to hard reset to this position, whereas I would like it a little bit further away and, like, maybe more of, like, a trying to get the right angle like, like maybe just like that angle like somewhere between those two so that's okay though this will work the hydra has inflicted incredible damage across the land there aren't many people left alive yeah we know we know sima it would have been impossible to have rebuilt the camp so quickly which means we must have gone back in time in that case there's something i really must do yes kagua the ability to travel through time depends on a person's memories. Draw upon those memories. Simply think about the people you wish to save. Cool. We have the blacksmith. What's going on over there? Why is this a little, like, island? Huh. Okay. I suppose that's fine. What's up? Huh? I thought you had just left. You certainly made it back here quickly. I know. I'm kind of a superhero. I don't remember seeing that in the camp. Proceed down this path to challenge the Hydra. Yeah, no, I'm good. Alright, we can go there. Let's go check out the blacksmith. I don't think there's going to be a lot for us to do at the blacksmith. Is there a run button? I can't remember. Fine. I I've been playing a few more of the Warriors games in general, so I'm kind of in a weird Warriors paradox where... I don't know what game has what anymore. <laughs> so it's fine. We'll figure it out as we go. How's it going? What can I do for you? At the blacksmith, you can purchase new weapons or fuse together two of your currently owned weapons to create a new powered up weapon. All right, that's cool. You can purchase weapons at the blacksmith by selecting purchase weapon. Weapons can be purchased with gems, which can be acquired in battle. If you have crystals, these can be used to purchase rare weapons. Weapon fusion allows you to combine two weapons into a single more powerful weapon. First, you must select your weapon to upgrade, then your weapon to fuse, which will disappear in the fusion process. In return for losing the fusion weapon, your upgraded weapon will receive attribute slots or attributes from the fusion weapon. For each lottery ticket you receive, uh, okay, that's apparently a thing, you will receive 10 weapons drawn at random when the lottery is drawn. Oh, uh, okay. Um, all right, let's see what we got. Uh-huh, yep. So from these three people, we have the Spear of the Sword and the Northern Cross. Okay, and a variety of different ones. We have some gems. I don't, I don't know that I want to do that yet. And then we have Weapon Fusion. All right, let's go take a quick look into our inventory. Is it in Battle Preparation? 
is it officer info? Oh, okay. This is where you can check your uh, check the ability levels and moves of all of your allied officers. All characters are divided into four attack categories, with each type featuring or each type features differing moves. The proficiency level of each character refers to the level of competence of the skills they each possess. Don't really know what that means. That's okay. All right, Sima is level seven. Just just rocking it. He is our sword boy. We got our spear boy, and we got our northern cross boy. Level three, level two, and level seven. G, F, G. So I guess F is probably the most of the proficient. I defeated quite a few enemy officers in that battle the other day. I suppose it could take some time off now. Hmm? No good? Okay. How do I... Preparations. This is where you can change... There it is. This is where you can change the equipped weapons and items of your team members. Each character can equip one weapon and two items. Alright. So, Iron Spear... And the Iron Spears level up as we go, if I call correctly. Absorption plus one uh, attribute info. Absorbs enemy life when it... Oh, done. You don't have to tell me twice. We have no items, huh? All right, Iron Sword. I know it's Celerity, but uh, I always want to call it Celery. Because, you know, why not? Uh, all right, what does Celerity do? Occasionally doubles movement speed upon defeating an enemy officer. Eh, okay. I mean, it's... It does seem somewhat limited in the number of slots it has, but that's okay. And then the Northern Cross. Okay, so since... I wonder why we have the plus one attack on those. Ah, it doesn't matter. It's fine. We're going to move the plus one. Distribute growth points. Uh, growth points acquired in battle can be freely distributed amongst your allies to improve their stats and level them up. We have a uh, 7317 in the way of growth points, and it says it can be distributed for stats and other two. Samurai 3. So we got Shu, Jin, Other 2, and then we got Samurai 3. Interesting. So we can do something with her? Is that a thing we want to do? Interesting. And really, it's just a way of allocating points to level up with. So if certain people fall behind... Okay, I mean, that's fine. And then we can promote. You can promote officers that have reached level 100. Oh my goodness. After being promoted, they will return to level 1. That doesn't seem like a good trade. But they will learn a second skill. Okay. Additionally, promoted officers will earn upgrade stones as they level up, which can be used to power up their abilities using the Use Upgrade Stones command. Officers can be promoted up to 9 times. Wow. That's tremendous. Fourth and subsequent promotions will provide the following benefits. Fourth is speed. Fifth is obtainable growth points. Sixth is the amount of attainable gems will be increased. Seventh, the amount of attainable gems will be further increased. Okay. Weird. But it seems like uh, there's a lot to this, so pretty cool. All right, let's let's uh, let's head to the the circle of love and and get going with it. <laughs> Proceed to the stage selection screen. Stop, stop saying no. Please say yes. There we go. All right. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Chapter 7, Chapter 3, Chapter 1. What? That's a little weird, right? That feels a little weird. Why is Chapter 4 there? Oh, the slaying of the Hydra. Ah. Well, that's interesting. Alright, what do we have? Using the mystic Kagua, Kagua's power to travel through time. Rescue your friends who were previously killed at Yiling. Alright, oh wait, we got DLC. What does that mean? I mean, I know what DLC means. Oh my god. Uh, dear lord. Uh, difficulties all seem a bit outside of our reach. 
So probably DLC comes near the end of days for us. Right, let's get back to the normal stuff and let's get into it. Uh, okay. Uh, I suppose we'll use our current team. And that, that is also the recommended team. Yeah. Uh, let's go for it. We could switch Vanguard. Eh, whatever. It doesn't matter to me. Uh, we'll stick to normal for now. We'll probably see if we can't do the, the power creep a little bit and, and upgrade it, but... Who can say? At the time, I had a bad feeling about things. Why did they remain behind and force me to proceed ahead? When I realized what had happened, I went back and found them. If I had to be given another chance, then... He's pretty upset, and rightfully so. The Battle of Yiling. The ability to travel back in time, the mystic Kagua possesses, or possessed unbelievable power. However, Ma Cheo was willing to try anything. Previously, Ma Cheo and his friends fled when the Hydra attacked and destroyed Shu, but they were ambushed when they arrived at Yiling. There, his friends gave their lives to help him escape, leaving him as the lone survivor. This time, he would make sure that everybody would live through the encounter. Macheo could not stop thinking about his companions as he traveled back to the past due to Kaguya's godly powers. Is this Yiling? You sent us back in time? Precisely. This is the moment from your past, Lord Machao. Well, if so, there's something that I must do at once. Uh, okay, there seems to be just so much going on right now on the map. Oh boy, howdy. Alright, well, we're going to hope that we can figure this out. Uh, accept missions, defeat 600 enemies plus 3 officers. I don't think that'll be a problem, but maybe it will. I don't know. Let's get into it. Look at all this stuff. All right, where are we going? Ooh, talk about an impressive army. Good thing we let the young master go on ahead. But I'm back, fools! I will not allow their sacrifice, sac sacrifice their lives to save mine. I'm gonna switch characters. Like that. Okay. Oh, no. Nope. It's all right. So they said something about you can go with this guy's power and you can keep attacking or you can hold it. Somebody was uh, telling me some advice on how this game works. So I'm going to be playing around with some of the controls and trying to get some stuff down a little bit better. Uh, we can't get bogged down too much with the things right now. It looks like if we just move in any one direction, we kind of sort of sprint. So we're going to go that route. Looks like we're coming up on a bad guy. Heal back. What? Where did you lot appear from? From your penguin. I got nothing. There's no, there's no lock. Okay. Oh, Hey, keel back. What's going on, buddy? Alright, so we battled our way through. Continued across the bridge. Kagiwa's uh, spirits, or our team is in high spirits. Uh, there's still some who assist the enemy very well. I shall have my puppet crush them. You have a puppet? I feel like that's not a very good uh, thing to... Use. Ooh, Kunoichi. Understood, I shall eliminate them. Shall you? You're stuck in a corner, lady. You've been cornered. She's not done yet. Ah, she is. Alright, Spear Boy did Spear Boy things. 
gotta throw it. Well, this is a surprise. The southern gates are open, and we're moving right along. Kunoichi's been captured. Ooh. Oh, no, what, 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 what am I? Hmm, it seems the spell's worn off yet. I do not have full mastery of this power. Oh. The horsemen are like, no, we don't want to mess with the spear boy. Kunoichi has been freed from the sorcery. The appearance of the Hydra is no longer about Wei and Shu. Therefore, it is the duty of a warrior to help warn his compatriots. Rescue Made. Hey, you struck me with your horse. We just reached a certain level of brilliance. Alright, let's move on. We can let our, our rabble clear up their rabble. Why are we so shiny? I mean, I'm not complaining, I'm just curious. Ooh, keg. There's a keg, guys and gals. Only good things come from this, right? Oh, it's a drum. It's definitely not a keg. But also, maybe it was a keg. I don't know. I've heard it both ways. What's going on? We're loading something. All right, who are these guys? Ooh, looking good. A little crossed uh, weapon situation. My day, Master Pang Day D. I I'm so sorry. Huh, young master, why have you returned? Why do you think? With our combined might, the warriors of Zhiliang cannot be stopped. Indeed. Well, I suppose this isn't such a bad thing after all. Well, I mean, it's, it's good to see uh, old friends, I suppose. I feel like maybe I should be playing as uh... Alright, we're doing it. It was an unnecessary sacrifice, but we shall live here together. I feel like I missed something I was supposed to do there. There it is, level up. I have no option, no other option but to withdraw. That's right. You withdraw, buddy. Oh, my horse. Oh. Is there any actual bad guys left? There, there is, that's it. Oh, we're doing the triple attack of death. We defeated Masakagasek and something another guy man. Okay. I am a most impressive fighter. Come here, horse. Uh, is this button? It is this button. Alright. That is getting back off the horse. Oh, look at this guy. What is he? Dude, gigantic. What? Oh, you're a big old pig boy. I've lost track of him. Where is he? Oh, is that him? Oh. Did I beat him already? I guess I already beat him. All right. All right, we're gonna go over here to Masatoyo Naito. <laughs> it's so weird. Oh, look at us. We just own that guy with our weird little helicopter maneuver. It's it's real weird. 100% here for it, though. All right. Looks like somebody's running from us, maybe. Masatane Hara. All right. Excuse me, pardon me coming through. You know what's about to happen, right? That's right. Get him, buddy. Yes, uh, all right. All these people are like stunned over here. And somebody's advancing. 
Wow, looks like our crew is growing quite extensively. We defeated 500 enemies. Of course. Where you at, buddy? Come here. We shall call you Pablo. Pablo the horse. Wait, hold on. There's somebody behind us. We should go deal with the guy behind us first, Pablo. You know, I don't feel like I'm any faster on horseback. I mean, maybe I am, but I don't feel any faster. We said good day, sir. All right, six enemies. We definitely defeated the three uh, three officers at this point. Kaguya's group is in high spirits. Can't say that I blame her in any way, shape, or form. All right, looks like we're about to come across a whole big old gaggle of uh, baddies that we are going to take down. They seem to not necessarily want to battle us. Honestly, who can blame them? I feel like I missed everybody. It's bad uh, positioning on my part. Get got, Yellow Belly and Mamushi. All right, Mabushi's gone. More people are advancing. We got somebody over here somewhere. Where, where are you at? This way. It's a Coltan. You get beat up by a little kid doing a propeller move. It's <laughs> so good. It's <laughs> so silly. I love it so much. I like it. I like it. All right. I may, uh, I may tweak the sound settings uh, in the uh, next episode, guys and gals. I feel like they're a little bit loud. Just, oh, uh, this appears to be the promised end. I shall leave the future to the hands of the next generation. Did we fail something? I have been slain by the demon army. Wait, where? I am else human has gone open the gate and eliminated for many enemies. Was that something that was supposed to happen, or did I fail an objective there? The Stone Sentinel Maze East is open. I mean, I thought I was taking care of stuff pretty well, but apparently that is not the case. All right, we're gonna go over here real quick. Take this guy, then we're gonna turn around and deal with whoever's coming from behind us. Oh, come on, this guy's. This guy doesn't even deserve me. Alright. We got cotton mouth over here. Alright. Fighting our way toward Cottonmouth. Bye, Cotton. Not too bad. Okay. I decided to do it on the fly, folks. Turn down the volume a bit. I don't know if it's uh, enough. We'll see. I don't know. Maybe maybe all the sounds are too, too loud at this point. We'll see. Looking over, I, like it doesn't feel that bad in my like my headset, but looking over at the at the actual sound wave thing, like the volume control on OBS, it does look like it's still a little high. It's all right. We'll see. Get no, get no bukumi, kimi. All right. Most impressive fighter. So we got quite a bit of just walking through stuff to do. 
What is all the stuff behind us? The, like, is it just things that we left behind? Hopefully they can handle stuff. That's what I would expect from the great much. See, I feel like the voices got even lower. The demon, Kiyomori, Tyra, used to be controlled by the humans and the spirits of the Alright. I'd heard he had come back, but it looks like he's even stronger. Alright. Just kind of blitzing our way through these guys. Oops, wrong button again. Sorry, guys and girls. Alright, no. I said good day, sirs. Ow. Actually, I did that. That was uh, a bit unfortunate. Alright, I'm going to have them back off. I, I don't really know if there's an advantage to having them up with me or not but I had them coming with me the whole time I don't know if they're just gonna like roam around and do other things all right all right boys come back out here in a second all right off the horse Seemed to be pretty decent. Did we defeat the guy? This dude just smacked me. Spell not holding much longer. Okay, the west are, is open now. Moving, we're moving right along. So, I wonder, I mean, it just seems like a, a straight advantage having these guys all up front with me. But, like, I can tell them not to be here. And, I, like, why would I do that? Like, what's the advantage to not having them there? Do I get more experience? Do they fight in other areas? Can I do that? Like, I mean, I can still swap between them at any point. So it's not like them not being close enough for me to swap with really changes anything. Not like I just, like, fires a, a blast of energy. All right. Out of my way, demon army. I said out of my way. Your head is mine. Is there somebody behind me? I feel like there's definitely somebody behind me. What? Combinate all three of you together. And you kind of know how this is about to go, right? Alright. This kind of works out quite well. And the spear said good day, sir. The name of justice. Impressive, but you are only delaying the inevitable. Maybe. The root of this world is a fate that cannot be avoided. Well, I mean, we, we have to try, you know? I mean... What are, we, what are we doing with ourselves if we're not at least attempting to stop the structure of the world? You know? So, the one you rescued... So, the the you that rescued us was the you that we protected before, but we didn't survive that encounter? Oh, I give up. This is also confusing. Whatever the case, we have been saved. You have my gratitude. From this moment forth, allow me to fight by your side. Yeah, you tell him, Peng D. Kunoichi, how embarrassing for a ninja like myself to fall for such sorcery. Well, I promise to work hard, so I hope you'll forgive me. Sure. However, it is a pity that we lost Master Huang Zhong. Zhong Zhong? I don't know. 
if only there had been a way for us to save him. So, so did I mess up or was that a thing that happened? It's true. We really can travel back in time, so all we have to do is go back to before the Hydra first appeared. If we do that, then we can... I'm afraid that is not possible. In order to go back in time, the person must exist not only in the present, but also in the past. Then I must follow the thread of existence that links that person's past and present lives. It is a difficult procedure, much like trying to cross a raging river on a thin piece of rope. However, the appearance of the Hydra has thrown the world into chaos and created a rift in time. Sure. The thread of existence cannot pass through that rift, so we can only go back to the origin of the Hydra. My fellow mystic is searching for a way to eliminate the Hydra. So for now, all you can do is try and save as many people as possible in order to swell your ranks. Okay, kind of makes sense. And I guess grow our power. We stop the Hydra. I think it would be best to find more comrades, like Lady Kaguya said. In which case, we'll need to secure Odawara Castle first. Not only can we use it as a base, but it's sure to have many people that we can recruit. However, in history as we know it, the demons surround and capture. Therefore, in order to prevent it from falling, Sima Zhao and I will have to go back in time. Sima Zhao will protect Yuda, Yuda Castle, and I will watch over Dong Ku. Master Mei Chao will also participate in this plan. That way our foes will have to split up to attack us. When they do, that's when we take back Odawara Castle. In our previous timeline, we tried to support the castle, but failed. That's my plan, so I hope you all do your best to carry it out. I mean, it, it kind of tracks. Makes sense. Matt Day has joined your cause, Panga D has joined your cause, and Kunoichi has joined your cause. Okay. I, I, I guess the, the level kind of, you know, worked out the way it was supposed to. Uh, acquired weapon, iron spear with agility. Uh, an iron sword. Northern Cross of Cavalier, a Lion Fang plus three, it increases attack. Uh, allied Soldiers Throwers, and Allied Soldiers, all Allied Soldiers become Throwers, excuse me. Um, Kunoichi, Peng D, and Made, and then we also have Enemy Soldier Throwers, all Enemy Soldiers become Throwers, Third Party Soldiers Throwers. Okay. All about Throwers, I guess. What, what is this? Obtain Strategy Cards. What does that mean? Reduces your officer's speed, increases defense. Oh, God. No. Uh, reduces your officer's defense, increases attack, probably. Uh, attacks opponent if successful, reduces opponent's attack. I mean, I kind of like this. That was impressive. Thank you. Okay, Battle of Yuda Castle is now available at the stage selection screen. Battle of Dongku is now available at the stage selection screen. Wallpaper for Amat Day is available in the gallery and is Peng Di and Kunoichi. New costume for Mei Chao is ready to go. And I guess we're heading back to our base camp, Pantalones de Fuego. All right, ladies and gents, looks like we have a few folks to talk to. And uh, yeah, not, not too bad. Not too bad. I think we uh, did quite all right. Uh, it went pretty well. I was able to kind of beat everything down. So I'm thinking maybe we'll try the next one on hard difficulty to see if uh, it brings about a bit more chaos and craziness. But we'll see. We'll see. All right, folks, till the very next episode, I have been your host, Bumpy McSquiggums. Thank you so much for stopping by The Freak Show. We play, we fight, we conquer.